Good morning world from the beautiful Shargout Island. I'm taking Poppy for a walk at sunrise. I don't often do this. Still in my pajamas. Actually, I didn't sleep at all last night. Could not sleep, mind was racing, so stayed up. Saw the sun rising outside the window. Realized it was nice and cool out here right now. Look at that beautiful, beautiful view. Yeah, that's it. Take a look at that view, Poppy. That's pretty epic, isn't it? What do you think? Enjoying the sunrise walk? There you go, Chalisi. Check out the moon up there. I think in the two and a half years, three years we've been living at this house, I've been down to this beach at sunrise maybe four or five times. I'm just not usually a morning person. I stay up at late at night sometimes to do work, but waking up in the morning is not my thing. Poppy doesn't seem to mind. Sometimes she'll wake up really early and she'll come from a walk like today, but we haven't actually had any whining or fussing from her. She really is the best dog we could have ever hoped for. You know, we said the same thing about our previous dog, Eden, as well. And Poppy's come into our life and she's almost exactly the same in terms of temperament. She fits into life really well. It's so beautiful. The weather is so nice today. It has been so incredibly hot over the last few days. So to get a morning like this feels amazing. What's really nice about this time of day as well is there's no mosquitoes. Oh, Sasha's come to join me must have heard me getting out of bed. <laughs> well, not getting into bed, actually. <laughs> Poppy just went crazy. She was jumping up and down like a lunatic. Look at you, loony. Excited to see mummy awake. She's probably thinking, what on earth is going on? Hello, did you just see her fall over? No, I saw her jumping up and down on you, though. She jumped like so flat on her face. Oh, <laughs> silly pop. This is a rare sight, isn't it? Yeah. To be up this early in the morning. Yeah, five. So yeah, it's about five o'clock. Yeah. Sun hasn't actually come over the horizon yet at all. Yeah, I see. see a tiny red sliver yeah, appearing. Oh, it's lovely and cool out here, though. I know, I've just been talking about how yeah, nice it is. Yeah. The story's fast asleep still. Yes, she, is. she probably won't wake up for another few more hours. <laughs> what do you reckon? Two yeah, more hours? Two hours, yeah, I think. And I saw that my mum was on. Instagram at three o'clock in the morning last really? night. Yeah, oh. she's been naughty. <laughs> so was I, I guess. Like I couldn't fall asleep, and I saw her like replying to comments and stuff. At three, and I was like, hmm. She'll be sleeping in. <laughs> yeah, she'll be sleeping in too. Are you ready for your morning yoga session? I am now, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I might sleep through the alarm, but yeah, I'm looking forward to it actually. First time in a very long time. I've done yoga and I saw the message go up yesterday and I was like, oh, I should fancy that. Go yeah, do a meditation class. So, yeah, let's see how it goes. Up here in the centre and north of Shargal, those kind of activities have taken a lot longer to resume, haven't they? Yes, compared to General Luna, yeah. General Luna was back up on its feet like a few days after the storm, kind of recovering, and most of the people from the north left for a long time and the ones that would be doing these kind of classes and stuff it took about a year before you could do it and now two or three places do regular yoga and meditation classes and stuff yeah. but they're normally by guest teachers who come to the island they'll do a few lessons and then you'd get to know them I guess and then they'd sod off wouldn't they? <laughs> like yeah. I don't know if I'd like that <laughs> because I mean like you build a, re a relationship with your teachers don't you? Yeah. It's the same with like a hairdresser. Yeah. If you have a good hairdresser, you kind of want to stick with them. And if they just keep going and you have to get to know someone new, yeah. not sure if I like that. <laughs> Look at this incredible scenery. Every morning this is happening, Sasha, outside our door. And we don't see it. Not often, no. well, I said we've probably only been down to the beach at sunrise maybe five times in three years. Yeah. Not much. The earliest that I'd normally take Poppy out is about six. Yeah. That's now. <laughs> yeah. 
not five. Poppy seems happy as anything. She's working at full speed as usual. There's no way we're going to keep up with her. Look at her go. Where's she going? Oh my goodness, Poppy is so fast. Look at that fog that's forming on top of the hill there. That's quite incredible. We don't normally see that kind of thing here on the island. Something you associate with the mountains in the Philippines. But to get it there on top of the hill, just haven't been up at the right time of day. The sun actually took much longer than I thought to poke out. But that looks really special, doesn't it? times like this I really do wish I had a better camera <laughs> to zoom in a bit more. Probably doesn't care but she's very independent isn't she? <laughs> she is yes. Just wander off, keep going, never look back. Oh she just looked back. Those ears are on high alert. Poppy has spotted another dog in the distance, she wants to go and play. There's two speedboats here going incredibly quick. It's kind of weird to see boats going this fast here in the Philippines and used to seeing the slow local fishing boats. Yeah, Poppy went to retrieve the dog. Yeah, she's playing with one of the white dogs here now. Seems to be friendly enough. Hello. Hello, sweetie. This is your friend from the streets. <laughs> Poppy, it's take it fun, easy. Hello. Take it easy, you beast. You get too excited, Pops. Look at her go. You made her cough. <laughs> Girl, what a morning for Poppy. Yeah. She's loving this. Look at that. Playtime. This is her friend from the street that she never gets to chase with because yeah. Poppy's on the lead on the street. That's true. But look how much faster she is. She is actually much quicker. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> so I'm quick, Poppy. So, if you've been watching our Hello. weekend vlogs, you will know this other dog already because on one of Story's bike rides, this dog turned up and his brother, I think, they're, or they're both girls, can you remember? No, they're both boys. Both boys, the ones yeah. That we see on the street. Story names Moonshine. Moonshine and, and Moonlight. Moonlight. <laughs> yeah. I think this one is Moonlight because it was the lighter coloured one. <laughs> Look at that beautiful morning light with Moonlight. Moonlight's gone to have his own little moment at sunrise, resting by the rock pool. Hey sweetie, sorry to disturb you, I just thought you looked really cute there. You know me now, we've met several times. You enjoying life? Maybe you'd like to come to our land here and become one of the land dogs. What do you reckon? Look at that flappy tongue. We put Poppy back on the lead for now because the other doggy, Moonshine, just ran off abruptly. I don't want Poppy to run to the road. Because sometimes you can go a bit crazy, can't you, Popster? Oh, you sweet dog, you're so beautiful. You're the colour of the sunrise. Yeah. I do look good in the morning light, don't I? I look beauty. As soon as that sun came over the horizon, you can start to feel the heat from it. It's crazy how much it changes. <laughs> Woohoo! Poppy run free. <laughs> look how much faster she is. <laughs> She's long gone. I just had a deja vu moment. Did you? Yeah. I remember one of the other times we experienced the sunrise together yeah. when we were just about to do a photo shoot to reveal <laughs> that you were pregnant yeah. with Story Aww. in Thailand. Yeah, we, I remember that very clearly. We went down to a local beach at sunrise and took pictures, you know, holding the bump or holding the tummy. There was no bump at the no. time. <laughs> but just as soon as I felt the warmth come over, yeah. I just started to remember and we had Eden with us, didn't we? Yes. Ah, uh, the dog. So it was just me, Sasha, and Eden at the time. She was our one and only daughter. <laughs> <laughs> so now feeling that warmth coming over the sea and thinking that's the same sun. Yeah. You know, it's an odd thought. That's lovely, that is, isn't it? It is lovely. Yeah. It's a very lucky moment. It feels yeah. really nice. It does. 
which is like happened by accident as well. We weren't supposed to be up. <laughs> something that started off kind of negatively, like can't sleep, turned into something beautiful. Where'd your friend go? Good girl, he's there. He brought your friend home. <laughs> yeah, look, he's actually walking around the land. We have to introduce him to Shalako. To make friends. Hey. And you can become one of our land dogs, what do you reckon? Good plan? Well, you're off home. You got somewhere else you need to be? Hey, moonlight? If you do, you're always welcome here. You're a sweet dog. Bye. A few hours have passed. Story's awake now. Yeah. You're carrying Mummy's yoga mat. Yeah. We're gonna have an early morning breakfast, aren't we? Yeah. It's a really like high contrast shadows going on here. Super sunny behind me. All that talk about being cool this morning. It's already baking hot and it's not even gone like quarter past seven. <laughs> we haven't been back here for a long time. Common Ground Cafe. This is where Sasha's going to do her yoga and we're going to get some food, hopefully. Hello, Barker. How are you? Right, so let's have a look at the games. I'm having a look at the menu. And Sasha is off for your yoga lesson, right? Yeah, I'll have breakfast afterwards. <laughs> I miss you. She's just going to be literally their story. Your zaps can reach me. sun is fully up now heading back from Pacifico. Did you enjoy watching mummy go to her yoga lesson? Yeah <laughs> and I met my friend Marley yes. years ago I met her but look what she offered me to keep. Show me. A hair clip yeah. and this rainbow ring. That's fantastic. Yeah. So it was a successful morning then. Yeah she, oh. she was very kind but a tiny bit naughty. Tiny bit naughty? Yeah. Aren't all kids a tiny bit naughty, aren't they? No, actually very naughty. You're the naughty one. She was the naughty. I, I stopped her. <laughs> How was the session for you? Really good. I'm very happy that I went. Um, it was super relaxing. The meditation at the beginning and then at the, we ended it with the meditation as well. And breathing exercises, it was really lovely. I felt so relaxed, like I was floating away. <laughs> and I got a good stretch as well, so yes. Exactly like what I wanted. Clouds. I did feel like I was walking in the clouds, yeah. <laughs> very, very nice. Well, that sounds like a good place to start rounding up the vlog. <laughs> so we are ending the day as we began it. Just me and Jay having a poppy walk on the beach. Very nice. But I'm going to do the shout out for today. And today's shout out is going to... Zhao Al Thor. Thank you, Zhao, for becoming one of our members. Really, really appreciate it. If you want to become a member yourself and get a shout out, there are links under the video and there's a join button if you're using a computer and it helps out our channel a lot. Hope you enjoyed today's video and we'll see you in the next one. See you Bye. Then. Bye.